Hey YouTube, how you guys doing? Um, this is me Aisha. Thank you guys for tuning in like always. So I am coming at you guys just really quickly popping in to show, show you guys what I'm doing with my hair at this moment. I just really want to share this with you. Um, I decided to do some two strand twists on my hair and it's coming out pretty nice. Um, I ordered some hair from ooh, uh, E Crater, Naffy Collection. I will make sure it's the top of the link in this video. And it is basically the Nappy Collection Afro Puffy Twist in color 1B. Here is the hair. Um, and this is the little pa uh, package um, card that goes on the hair. Um, I've seen quite a few people do this. It was a young lady on here. I'm, I'm going to put a link to her YouTube and her video that when I seen her hair, I just had to have it, had to have it. She used three packs of hair. I purchased three packs of hair, but realistically, um, you don't have to. I caught it. I could have got away with two packs. In my hair right now is two packs of hair. Okay. I just took this out the packet. So this is how the hair comes. Okay. It is a rubber band in between the hair. And you have to separate the hair to make sure it is all on the correct side of the rubber band. So here's the hair and it comes in little sections like this. You know, it's already sectioned off for you. Um, it is quite a bit of hair. You know, like I said, you could get at a weight, you know, maybe even one and a half packs, just depending on how big your head is and the size of it the actual twist you are going for. But I really wanted mine full. I kind of want mine like a diva full hairstyle. Um, the ends, they're okay. Um, I'm probably still going to put rollers on the end of mine. They're all right. Um, they look better than the other hair that I get from the beauty supply store. But I'm just going to go ahead and show you guys really quickly how I do it. I'm not even tripping off a straight part right now. This is the amount of hair I'm taking. I'm going to twist it. Mm -hmm. Take a little bit less, a little bit more out. So, just trying to make sure it's even on both sides. Now, if you guys see my box bag tutorial, I'm going to go do the same thing, but then I'm going to switch it up a bit just to create the twist, okay? Wrap the hair around and begin to braid. This is my third little piece, okay? And I'm going to braid for a moment, and I like to twist to the right. And when, when I twist to the right, I make sure that my hair is on this side, okay? My hair is going to be on the right side. So when I twist, as you guys see, here's my hair. And it's on the right side. When I tw begin to twist, the actual synthetic hair is going to go over my hair and that helps camouflage, okay? And then you begin to twist. All right, when I get to the end, I just make sure I separate enough to where I have an even amount on both sides. And I just continue to twist and I'm smoothing and twisting the hair. Get to the end, I kind of roll it with my fingers. And there, voila, I have a twist. Okay, you two, so now I am finally done braiding my um, two strand twist. Um, and I love them. So this is the finished result. This is actually the next day. I got done really late. It is absolutely gorgeous. I love it. Here is the back. The hair came out really nice. I love it. I love it. It looks nice like this with the, I guess, little natural ends. But I'm going to go that extra step and I want to dip them. I want kind of want to glam it up a bit. And I'm going to use rod rollers. I have a bag of rod rollers here. Um, I'm probably going to have to use these two sizes um, because I don't have a whole bunch of the gray ones. So I'm probably going to have to mix them. Let's see. You just grab some pieces. You can probably do two or three at a time. It's all up to you. And you just roll it. And then you go up. And that should be far enough for me. I do not want and curl it all the way up like that, okay? So then you have it like that. So I'm just gonna continue all the way around the head till they're all done. 
Okay, you guys, I have the rollers in some of my hair. I don't have them in all because I didn't have enough. I'm going to have to dip and then re-roll the remaining, okay? So, like always, you need to make sure you have a towel to protect yourself. And I have a cup of hot water. And all you do is just take the hair and dip it in, okay? That's it. Remove your cup. Take your towel and squeeze. So I'm going to do the rest off the camera so because it's safer and I will be back. YouTube, um, so I'm back and this is the final result of my hair. I took out the rollers and yeah, I'm loving it. I'm kind of liking it better the other way without the rollers, but this is still very, very cute. I still do like it. Now this is maybe two days later after I've recorded the first thing, um, first um video of me putting the rollers in because th that took forever rolling it because I have so much hair and then dipping it safely um took forever and when I got done I was tired and I went to work and I just hadn't had time so now right now if I'm looking pretty whooped up it's because it's one in the morning and I said let me go in and let's do this video while it's still looking good so this is how it looks um when I put the rollers in it And this is the back. So yeah, it still looks very, very cute. Um, but I think I, next time I do my hair, I'm not gonna roller it, penny rollers. And I think I'm just gonna leave it looking um, with the little, you know, straight ends. I tried my best to get the ends to curl up on the, um, when I had them, when I just twisted it. But they weren't curling the way I wanted to. So this is the finished result of my puffy, my afro puffy twist <laughs> that I had put some um, rolls on the end, did and kind of gave, you know, a little, a little twist, okay? So please let me know what you think about this look. Um, yeah, and I'll be back with more videos. Like I always say, stay blessed, stay beautiful, but always stay you. I am going to bed. I'm tired. Ciao.